Good day everyone and welcome. You have been playing Boilers 3 for a while and like to see a little bit different loot than normally or you have be you have heard about this awesome exclusive loot what you can get only from events like Valentine's Day or Halloween and don't want to wait those events. Borderlands 3 modding is raising its head and we are getting more mods in it all the time. Two very interesting mods are expanded legendary loot pools and DLC loot de-improviser. Loot pool mod change all DLC and event legendary gears as world drops and can be dropped wherever in game just randomly. The improviser change DLC gear drop. Normally when you play DLC you get most likely DLC gear, but this mod randomize all gear and make drops much more interesting. Remember, if you find this video helpful, click like button and subscribe channel for future content. So how we can install mods for Borderlands? It's very simple. You add a few files in Borderlands folder and install mods in browser. But let's show you step by step how to download those files and install mods for your game. First, you want to locate your Borderlands 3 file. Open Steam library, find Borderlands, open properties and click local files and browse. Then Oak Games, Binaries and Windows 64. And there you find borderlands.exe. Leave this folder open. Then we open our first link in description. This is plugging loader. Scroll down and download d3d11 zip file. Open this file and copy, copy files and paste in your Windows 64 folder which you opened earlier. Folder where your Borderlands 3.exe is. And now plugin loader is installed. Easy, right? Then you can close your zip folder you downloaded, but leave Windows 64 folder open. Our next step is install Hotfix Merger. Click second link in description, download B3 hm zip file, open that file, then open plugins folder in Windows 64 folder. You added this folder in previous step. Then you just copy files from B3HM folder and paste in plugin folder. And now hotfix merger is installed. Next step we have configured hotfix with our game. So start Borderlands and you should get hotfix merger icon in your taskbar. Click open web UI. And now issue what I had. If your game is running background and hotfix merger is saying that web socket disconnected this doesn't mean that you have made mistake. Try other browser. Just copy hotfix merger link and paste in other browser. I was testing this first with Brave, but got only disconnect message. But soon as I opened merger in Edge browser, it connected normally. Merger must be connected so you can add mods. Once your merger is connected properly, you see green text top of screen, everything is fine and we can install mods. Click third link in description and click this third file expanded legendary pools.py. Then click raw and copy that URL link. Go to hotfix merger tab, click add URL and post link you copied and click OK. 
now you have added your first Borderlands mod in your game. Congratulations! Let's install the second mod right away and then jump in game. So click fourth link in description and choose again third file dot py file. Click raw, copy URL link, go into merge hotfix merger and post URL and then everything is done. Now you can jump in game. Wait it to reload. Once it's reloaded, we can check one more time in Fox Hotfix Loader. And down here we have log. And if everything is green slash yellow, we are good to go. In game menu, you see here your hotfixes. First number is how many hotfixes is modded and second number is total hotfix amount. Every time you make changes for mods, install or delete, refresh game clicking exit to title screen. Every time you enter in title screen, game will download those hotfixes and check that everything is correct. This way you can install any mods from GitHub now, you can enjoy modern borderlands, happy gaming moments, and see you next time.